What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel and I cannot believe I am making another sneak peek video. Since it is the weekend, I had no idea that Netmarble would be dropping another sneak peek. These guys completely caught us off guard. Unfortunately, once again, there is no game content hinted in the sneak peek. All we really got was confirmation that yes, we are indeed 100% getting x23 and we're seeing what the character model looks like that is it and unfortunately for me he's not as thick as i like him but satan is getting a uniform so you know i got my fix right there anyways i'm a little bit too overzealous for that satan uniform so yeah i'm really excited about x23 i'm gonna have a lot of fun with her and I know a couple people are already saying that she's probably going to be an epic quest. And if that's the case, more power to Netmarble. We need more game content. Although that's not replayable game content, I would like something else in addition to an epic quest. I'm not going to ramble on and on about a picture of just X23. For this one, I'm actually going to be sharing the results of my event chess with you guys because i had a couple of you guys ask me what is the best thing i got from these chests because a lot of you guys have been getting rank up tickets and you guys already know i have a whole bunch that i can't use so i'm very sad about that and to be honest with you guys because of that because these things don't stack on top of each other which is very annoying and i feel like they should make it so that they stack on top of each other because they're just eating up space and yeah sure i could use the tier two tickets but apart from that i can't really use these because all of my characters for the most part are at six stars right so i'm really scared to open these chests right here because if i get a whole bunch of rank up tickets while that is probably the best thing you can get well not probably definitely the best thing you can get i can't use them and it's gonna force me to spend crystal to expand my freaking slots like 10 slots for 100 crystals is not worth it to me so i was very sad about that however this is on an unlimited timer so i was thinking to myself maybe i should just wait and see what the update looks like but i keep getting asked by you guys what did you get what did you get what did you get so for this video i'm gonna open as many of them as possible and and show you guys what is inside for me because RNG Jesus is never very kind for me and to be honest the only thing that I would want out of this chest is not even in there all I really want and all I've been wanting for a very long time is actually a couple three star tickets because as you guys can see I have a couple four stars and I have a whole bunch of fives and a few sixes and the thing is if you take a look at my roster I know this is kind of like a vlog video, but you guys are probably not here for that. So sorry about that. If you take a look at my roster, you see that I have a couple characters here that are at one star and I need a three star ticket to rank her up. And then I can use my fours and fives to get her to six star because I feel like using a six star mega rank up ticket on a two star character that is a bio sub is kind of a waste because I'm wasting 20 bios that I can put towards your gear. I know I'm nitpicking, but that's just the kind of person I am. I'm trying to save that 6 star mega rank up ticket for maybe Kid Kaiju, Riri and maybe Anti-Man or Nova but I'm kind of hoping that there's another way for them when the update drops. Another thing that I'm really looking forward to for update 3.7 is the loot box being gone. So when that patch note gets dropped, your boy is going to be looking forward to seeing what Netmarble actually says about the loot box and where those characters will be going because that's one of the biggest things in update 3.7 for me. Anyways, let's go ahead and open some of these chests and see what's inside, man. Okay, so ISO, 6 star ISO, that is very good. Unfortunately, that's taking up space. Gold. I wouldn't mind taking a couple million in gold. That's garbage. Um, okay. Gold. Okay, I'll take clear tickets. I wouldn't mind getting like a couple thousand clear tickets and calling it a day, to be honest. All right, five star. Gold. All right, that's what I'm talking about. Just hit me with clear tickets and maybe hidden tickets and call it a day. That's garbage. Uh, mm, that's garbage. Uh, whatever. 20 energy. Could have at least given me 100. Oh, that's nice. Okay, so the best things I've gotten so far are two six star ISOs couple fives as well another five star ticket like these things need to stack man because 
I'm getting really annoyed. Like, I never thought I would get to the point in the game where having something as premium as a rank up ticket is actually an annoyance to me. And I feel like that's very, very bad for me to be in a mind state that like, like having too much of a premium item you know like like really <laughs> you should never be in that state well that's actually pretty nice that's what a day of getting that one kill against a world boss okay i can take those 20 tickets so far it's actually wow <laughs> all right so i got two five stars and a couple okay I feel like most people would be very sad getting the gold and they would more than likely want their rank up tickets but for me at this point see like like even this this is just like uh like all i'm thinking about right now is how much inventory space i'm gonna have after all this because to be honest with you guys the majority of the time i spend playing this game right now is managing my inventory it's crazy it's actually crazy that I've got to the point where because of how cheap I am and because I do not think that spending 100 crystals to get 10 freaking space in your inventory is worth it so I won't ever partake in it, I have to micromanage my inventory so freaking much. And it makes being a hoarder in this game real, real bad for me. <laughs> okay. So far, I think I've gotten like what, like 70 clear tickets? That's actually pretty good. I wish I wasn't getting these five star chips though, but I know some of you guys who like to not run story missions benefit from those love love chips. Wow, There's actually a good bit of six star ISOs in here. Okay. Guess I'm gonna try and use up as many tickets as possible on the characters that come in this update. Because otherwise, I am going to be up. I'm going to be in a real bad position in terms of inventory space. 10 energy, that's an insult. Well, I guess I could flip that into a legendary chest in co-op invasion. <laughs> like that's going to happen. I feel like the goal could have been higher. Wow. I wish there was a trading system in this game that I could just trade like 10 of those freaking um, rank up tickets for something else. You know, like I would love to be able to trade them to some of you guys who are just starting out and you desperately need those to catch up. But that day will never come because if trading comes in this game then yeah there's gonna become a black market for people to sell stuff for cash and and that marble ain't with that guys you already saw what happened when um people started selling crystals and using credit cards and all that stuff because of the whole loot box for the um comic cards i got a good bit of energy out of that gonna have to dump that into a rift after Word of advice, oh, I got a six star ISO there. Word of advice to you guys who like to let your energy sit above the cap. For every hour that you're above the cap, you're an hour behind me. Okay, so if you're already behind me in terms of characters that you have developed and you let your energy, because I see people who are proudly saying they have like thousands of energy stacked up. That's it. <laughs> I'm just thinking to myself, like you're wasting so much time, like so much time. And the longer you let your energy stay above the cap, the further behind you get when it comes to playing in this game. So for me, that's why if you take a look at my videos, 90% of the time, I don't have my energy filled because I just burn it as soon as I get it. And wow, I actually, I'm very, very surprised that I got through all of that and I didn't run out of inventory space. Wow, I only got 40 things that took up space. Okay, so yeah. I didn't even keep track of how many things I got. I'll let you guys <laughs> keep track of that. I don't think I got any six star tickets though, which is kind of sad. I would have liked to get one, but I think I have enough here. One for Nova, one for Anti-Man, one for whoever else. Yeah, I have enough. 
would have liked to get a freaking six star mega rank up though but it is what it is it is what it is i don't want to keep you guys too long man that's all i really had to say for this one i guess i could drop some energy in there and drop some you know getting some urus but yeah <laughs> like always man thank you guys so much for watching you guys are the best i absolutely love conversing with you guys in the comments on a daily basis so thank you guys so much for all the love and support and i will see you guys for the next video the actual video that should have been released today so yeah peace out i'm done